Hello students, welcome to E-Class. I am Sabha Shukrat. Today I am going to teach you English and the topic is Masculine Femina. Before going to the topic, I am going to ask a question regarding nouns. Do you know what are nouns? Oh, great. All of you are well aware of nouns. So, nouns are the naming words used to name a person, place, animal, or a thing. Today we are going to learn about genders. Have you ever heard the word gender? Oh no? So don't worry. I'm going to explain it and you can easily understand what is gender. Gender is a category of a noun. Every noun indicates that whether the person and the animal we are talking about is a male or female. Examples. Example number one. My friend's name is Musa. Can you judge from the name whether the friend is a boy or a girl? Yes, you can judge that Musa is a boy. So the friend is male. Now, look at the example number two. My friend's name is Sana. Now, can you judge from the name whether the friend is a boy or a girl? Yes, we can judge that Sana is a girl. So the friend is female. We come to know that the name Musa is used for male. Similarly, the name Sana is used for female. We have different naming words for male and female. These words are called masculine and feminine. Be careful. Whenever I will say masculine, it means I am talking about males. Similarly, when I will say the word feminine, it means I am talking about females. So look at the book and read it along with me. Masculine nouns represent males like boys, men and keep one important thing in your mind. There are also male animals. Is it clear that there are also male animals? Clear? Okay. Now, we'll move further. Whereas, feminine nouns represent females, like girls, women, and female animals. Now, let's have a look at some more examples of masculine and feminine. Masculine can be a boy, a man, an uncle, and a grandfather. Some examples of feminine. Feminine can be a girl, a woman, a mother, and a grandmother. So these are the examples of feminine. I think I am clear till now. And you can easily recognize whether the name or gender we are talking about is male or female. As I told you earlier that animals also have genders. Is it clear? Animals also have genders. So, look at the pictures and read with me. Now, look at the picture one. It is a fox. And you know that fox is a masculine noun. And its feminine noun is vixen. What is it? Vixen. V-I-X-E-N. Vixen. Now, look at the next picture. The next picture is of peacock. What is it? Peacock. P-E-A-C-O-C-K. Peacock. And its feminine gender is P-E-A-H-E-N. P-E-N. Look at another picture of a horse. Horse is a masculine noun. And its feminine is a male. What is it? Male. M-A-R-E, mirror. So students, 
you need to learn the spellings of masculine noun as well as feminine nouns. Is it clear? Good. Now look at the next picture. The next picture is of a rooster. What is it? Rooster. R-O-O-S-T-E-R. Rooster. And its feminine noun is hen. What is it? Hen. The pronoun we used for masculine or a male noun is he. And the pronoun we used for feminine or a female noun is she. Students, I'm going to teach you some masculine and feminine nouns. What you need to do is, you have to read them after me. First is bull. Bull is a masculine noun and its feminine noun is cow. What is it? Cow. Next is a gander. Do you know students, what is a gander? Gander is a kind of a bird. A male bird and its feminine or female noun is goose. What is it? Goose. G double -O -S -E. Goose. Next is waiter. Waiter is a masculine noun and its feminine noun is waitress. Its feminine noun is waitress. Good. Some more examples of masculine and feminine for your better understanding. First is lion. Lion is a wild animal and all of you are well aware of it. Do you know what is its feminine noun? Yes, its feminine noun is lioness. What is it? Lioness. Now come to the next. King. You might have seen King in the cartoon movies wearing crown and rolling over the country. Do you know what is its feminine noun? Great! Its feminine noun is queen. What is it? Queen. Look at the next. Boy. Boy is a masculine noun and its feminine noun is girl. What is it? Girl. Next comes brother. Brother is a masculine noun and its feminine noun is sister. What is it? Sister. Father and its feminine is mother. Some more examples of masculine and feminine son, daughter, son, daughter, uncle, aunt, uncle, aunt, tiger, is a masculine noun and its feminine noun is tigress. What is it? Tigress. T I G R E S S. Tigress. And next is nephew. Nephew is a masculine noun and its feminine noun is niece. Students, nephew can be the son of one's brother or sister. Similarly, niece can be the daughter of one's brother or sister. Clear? And the last one is Prince is a masculine noun. And its feminine noun is Princess. What is it? Princess.